<coughs> okay, kids, here we are. We got the Bud Ice. Now we're gonna see if this baby will smoke like a natural ice or if it's all hype. Oh my god, what we're seeing here, we have the clear bottle, which is always a bad sign. It's uh, bragging about having 5% alcohol. If anything has that, the dishwater could be and more alcohol than that. Depends on who's doing the dishes. Baptizing bullshit. See what she can do. It comes with an easy twist. A moment of truth. Is it better than natural ice or not? It smells like piss. Natural ice. Like this. We're going to have to get a side by side comparison. Tastes like it's got less stuff in it than natural. This is definitely a pussy version of natural ice. This is like the runoff shit. Like throw away. Bud ice. Our exclusive ice brewing process produces a smooth taste. It's like trash. Ugh. That's what we'll have to do. Uh, overall, I will not spend more money for this product. It's trash. Man, I got a 12 back too. Everybody going with it? Okay, kids, we're back here at hour 41 of the Bud Ice Challenge. And I can hardly feel the effects at all. So I'm not really that confident in what it can deliver for a punch. Bud Ice. Butt blood, butt liquor, butt wiper. Ah! Tastes like a cunt. Natural ice is so much better than this. Save yourself. Save yourself the aggravation. Grab yourself one of these. Oh, so it's better. And I don't even understand. I don't like the labeling personally, but it does look like an 18th century British painting of some kind. It's like a tapestry of sorts. Bud Ice, there's nothing to this. The labeling shit, they didn't have a fucking clear bottle. That's not right. It's not how beer works. It was dirt cheap was why I got it. Bud Ice Lager. Ugh. Anyway, off to the bar to get fucking trashed again and once again, I excuse, uh, excuse me for all the remarks that I made in my last thing. I really didn't mean any of it. 